Hello, welcome to the Robotics for Kids tutorial. My name is Emerike Adeze. I'm a STEM education facilitator and I'll be your guide through this video. In today's session, we'll be discussing about the planet Uranus. It is the seventh planet from the sun and the third largest planet in our solar system by size. This planet is the closest ice giant to the sun it's very cold and windy in Uranus, and it is surrounded by 13 faint rings. It was given the name Uranus after the Greek god of the sky, Uranus. Here are some basic information about this planet. It has 27 moons. Its average distance from the sun is 1.8 billion miles. It takes 17 hours and 14 minutes for Uranus to complete a rotation, that's a day while it takes 84 8 years for uranus to complete a revolution that's a year the temperature can go as low as minus 337 degrees fahrenheit its mass is 14 and a half times more than Earth's, and of course this planet is an ice giant uranus is the first planet to be discovered with the aid of a telescope it was found in 1781 by astronomer William Herschel. Although he originally thought it was either a star or a comet, as most people in the past have thought. It was two years after this discovery that this planetary body was universally accepted as a new planet, in part because of observations by another astronomer, Johann Allard Bode. Williams tried unsuccessfully to name his discovery Georgium Sidus, meaning Georgian star, after King George III. Instead, the planet was named Uranus after the Greek god of the sky, as suggested by Johann Bode, because most persons outside Europe were not in support of the name Georgium Sidus. Uranus is one of the two planets that rotate in opposite direction to other planets from east to west in a retrograde manner. This ice giant is surrounded by 13 faint rings and 27 small moons as it rotates at a nearly 90 degrees angle from the plane of its orbit. This unique tilt makes Uranus appear to spin on its side, orbiting the sun like a rolling ball. Uranus's atmosphere is mostly hydrogen and helium, with a small amount of methane and traces of water and ammonia. This methane gives Uranus its unique blue color. Now let's take a look at some fun facts about the blue ice giant. At number one, we have the rings. Uranus, like other giant planets, has 13 known rings around it. The innermost rings are narrow and dark, while the outermost ones are brightly colored. While at number two, we have temperature. Uranus has the coldest planetary atmosphere in the solar system, with a temperature of minus 371 degrees Fahrenheit. Uranus is termed the coldest planet. This planet is also incredibly windy. At the third spot, we have movement. While other planets rotate neatly on their axis, some with slight tilt, Uranus is basically the opposite, as it rotates in a retrograde manner and is positioned differently. Scientists believe that something massive must have collided with the planet billions of years ago, completely knocking it over on its side. Jupiter has a tilt of around 3 degrees and Earth has a slighter greater one at 23.5 degrees. In comparison, Uranus is tilted to around 98 degrees. So while other planets rotate like spinning tops, Uranus pretty much looks like it is rolling on its stomach. This also means that its equator is almost at a right angle to its orbit. Watch this next slide to understand this better. Imagine our solar system as a dance floor. The planets are moving to pretty much the same rhythm. But one of them is doing the side shuffle. The rebellious Uranus. Just how different is Uranus dance? Very different. While Earth's axis is tilted about 23 degrees, Uranus tilts almost 98 degrees. 
Uranus axis is so tilted, it actually looks like the planet is rotating on its side. How did this all happen? One theory is that a body the size of our Earth collided with Uranus a long time ago, radically throwing off its rotation. Until we know for sure, the planet's strange tilt remains one of the great mysteries in the dance of the universe. And Uranus will keep doing the side shuffle like nobody's watching. And finally, at the last spot, number four, we have day and year. While a day on Uranus, that's a complete rotation, takes 17 hours, a little more than 17 hours. A year, a complete revolution, takes almost a lifetime, 84 8 years. This mainly is as a result of its distance from the sun and consequently its larger orbit. Since its discovery in 1781, Uranus will be completing its third revolution around the sun in 2033. I know that's an interesting fact. We'll be stopping here today. Do complete your crossword puzzle and of course, stay tuned.